Hi friends, what's up? This is Dr. K from 360D. It's time to talk about the best tips to fix ghost touch on iPhone. Nothing is more terrible than finding your iPhone in the grip of the ghost touch. When it triggers, your iPhone seems to be automated by an invisible spirit and starts doing things like making a phone call, launching an app, or even deleting files on its own. When your device is being haunted by this dreading issue, you are either bamboozled with disbelief or left scratching your head wondering what the hell is going on. But both or not, I have found out some workable tips to fix the problem. That said, let's dive right in. First off, I would recommend you to clean the touch screen with a soft cloth. Not many of you may believe the fact that the pile-up of dust is one of the most stimulants of the ghost test problem on iOS. If it's been a while since you cleaned your beloved iPhone, I suspect the devil could be hidden in the dusty layer itself. Use a soft and lint-free cloth to gently clean the touch screen. Once you have removed the dust, reboot the smartphone and use it for a while to check if the haunting ghost has gone and gone for good. If the problem is sorted out, you have gotten the better of the problem. Next up, I would suggest you to remove the screen protector from your device. Most cheap screen protectors tend to become unresponsive when they get old, so remove the screen guard to check if the problem is with the touch screen or the screen guard itself. Then I would suggest you to make sure you are using a certified charger. Fake or uncertified chargers are also responsible for invoking the ghost test problem on iPhone. If your charger is not MFI, aka made for iPhone or iPad, there is a good chance that the charger is at fault. After that, I would suggest you to hard reset your iPhone. When it comes to fixing touchscreen related issues, Force Restart Aka Hard Reset has a pretty good track record. Therefore, I will suggest you to give it a chance as well. On iPhone 8 or later, you have to quickly press and release the volume up button. Then press and release the volume down button. Then you have to hold down the side button or the power button until you see the Apple logo on the screen. And on iPhone 7 or 7 Plus, you have to hold down the volume down button and the side button at once until you see the Apple logo on the screen. And on iPhone 6s or earlier, you have to hold down the home button and the power button or the top button at once until the Apple logo shows up on the screen. Then I would suggest you to update the software on your iPhone. Some rare software bugs are also equally responsible for the ghost touch issue. You can get rid of such bugs through software update. Therefore, go for it. To do so, open the settings app on your iPhone. Now tap on general. Then tap on software update and finally download and install the latest iteration of iOS as usual. And finally, I would suggest you to factory reset your iPhone. Factory Reset has long been my go-to troubleshooters for fixing an annoying issue like this one, so I'm going to count on it one more time. It's important to know that it will wipe out all the existing settings, but your media and data will remain safe. To do so, open the Settings app on your iPhone. Now tap on General. Then you have to scroll down to the bottom of the screen and tap on Transfer or Reset iPhone. Then tap on Reset. After that, tap on Reset All Settings. Then enter your device passcode and confirm the action. After your device has rebooted, use it for some time to figure out if you have resolved the ghost touch on your iPhone. And that's pretty much it. So, these are the most reliable tips and tricks to fix ghost touch on iPhone. Hopefully, you have gotten the better of the problem. If you found this video helpful, do like and share it and I'll see you in the next video with more such handy tips and tricks. Till then, stay safe and have a good time. Bye-bye.